Uh, let's set off to the uh, Costa del Comedy now. Uh, Geordie Star, from mm. one Geordie to another, in yeah. fact. See, there's a pr pretty one. Here's another. <laughs> how are you? Tim Healy. Good, I'm fine, sir. Everything all right? You must be very proud up in that part of the world of uh, how well Cheryl's done. Oh, fantastic. Oh, yeah. She's done well. She's done brilliantly, yeah. A lovely Geordie girl as well, and mm. uh, good luck to her. And she looks a lot better in a dress than you do in your latest role. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, you know. well, when you saw the script... Depends who you want to, who you want to be, isn't <laughs> it? I think, I think you look lovely personally. Well, but well we're all coming out now. What character <laughs> do you play? What character do you play? Tell us about it. Well, really, he's, um, he's a man in the wrong clothes, you know. And I think that's the brilliant thing about England now, is that, you know, the great thing about England is you can just be who you want to be. And he's a, uh, he's a uh, transvestite. Uh, gear, look, yes, and loves it. Yes, and, and, and he's he, up for it. And, and he and he meets Johnny Vegas's <laughs> character, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what happens then? Well, uh, we have a, we have a blind date, and sadly Johnny is expecting probably you know like Raquel <laughs> Welch to walk around the corner, and instead he gets stuck with me. Yeah, well with Leslie. Oh, she's, she's Leslie. Cool. That would be a bit of a letdown, wouldn't it? Well, I think that was a bit horrific. Yeah. Okay, this is this is the Oracle's awkward blind date. It's uh, from um, tonight's episode. Have a look at this. Yeah. <laughs> Nice timing, great, great stuff. Do you enjoy doing, working with him? Oh, it was, uh, it was just one of those, uh, you know, days where you go to work and you just laugh at that until your belly yeah. starts aching. And then uh, Johnny's great to work with. We worked together before, a couple of years ago, we did a TV series together. So, would you, we, you know, when you get the crew, all the, the cameramen just mm. yeah. laughing as soon as they see a cut, everybody, ah, it was... Yeah, nice, nice to work there. Just but, and, and working at a real resort as well, Tim. Oh, yeah, I mean, I mean uh, yeah, it's not the sort of place I would go on holiday, to be honest with you. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? Well, you know, it's, um, you know, it's bacon and eggs and beans and chips, and, and no. they showed me actually um, a photograph of Benidorm in 1969 when it was a beautiful mm, little fishing you know, Spanish village. Fi fishing village. Mm. But it's, it's just become, you know, this mad place, for, uh, excuse for people there. Yeah. 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 yeah, that's fine, but. Um, so half the crew in here are booking up their place <laughs> now. They <laughs> love it. Yeah. Sounds all right. It's yeah. all right. It's all right, Tim. How's, yeah. um, how's Mrs? How's Denise, your, uh, yeah. your particular loose woman there? She's fine. She's fine. She's back on uh, loose woman again, just finishing uh, Waterloo Road. So that's me sitting, biting my nails again for the next year. And, uh, <laughs> that's the life of the actor. The mouth of the time is back. <laughs> you, you. So <laughs> it, uh, she gives me a bit of stick, you know, but uh, right. I don't normally listen to her and just, you know, feel a draft. But, uh, <laughs> Do you ever? Well, there you go. Do you ever, do you ever get nervous? Well, you're going to be, you should be nervous going watch, home now. Do you watch her? Do you watch Loose Women? Do you well, well, uh, well, well, only if I mean. I'm not a sort of like uh, a daytime TV person, to be honest with you. You know what I mean? No. When I was a young lad, there wasn't any morning TV at all, you know. There wasn't uh, any women on TV? Well, what did you not say? a lot. There wasn't no, any morning, morning TV. morning TV. <laughs> yeah, that's my accent. I'm so sorry. You're struggling with the accent. You've never yes, you had a Geordie yeah. accent yourself. I'll change. There I you go. used to live in Newcastle. I used to be a Geordie. And what happened here? I moved down south, became yeah. a bit of a softie. Yeah. You've lost it. What a no. shame. Never mind. I'll go yeah. back up north, reclaim it. <laughs> <laughs> Do you ever get nervous about what Denise is going to say about you on air? Well, if I did, I would I'd have a big problem, wouldn't I? Yeah. No, it's a bit of fun. I think, you know, really, once your missus stops talking about you, mm. you've got a problem. Really. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's right. She <laughs> forgets your name. You know what I mean? <laughs> Which is, uh, exactly. A bit of a Which giveaway. She, uh, yeah. She's normally quite harmless, but, like, any, you know, she... Uh, <laughs> It's like being married to a racehorse, really. She's on, you, yeah. she's on the reins, you know. You've got to, whoa, you've got to hold her back. That's she's the sort, a, she's of, a sort of woman she is, really. Thoroughbred. She's fantastic. Nice talking with you. Pleasure. Benadorm tonight. Yeah. Who knows after that? You chose the life of an actor. Well, there you go. It might, it might be my new role. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it was great fun to do. It was absolutely. You can people play like any the role he wants. I bet you like wearing so. a dress, did you? What was that like? I tell you what, the heels are hard work. How you girls are, walk along in them? I mean, that, my calf's the next day, and I only walked about 50 <laughs> yards. It were in a lot of pain. Well, you look very cute. Tim, <laughs> Tim good to see you. Much. Love Thank to you very much. Thank All you the very best. Much. Thank you. Now, if you've missed this week's competition so far, here's how you can try and win the ultimate holiday to Australia and £3,000 spending money. Kirsten O'Brien's got the This week, we're giving you the chance to win the ultimate holiday experience.